Assalamu alaikum ya Rasulullah. Assalamu alaikum wa alaikum ya Habibullah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video we are going to be talking about the big SM. Now what is SM? I am talking about social media. I am talking about all those Instagrammers, I'm talking about all those TikTokers, I'm talking about all those people who misuse YouTube. Any form of platform, Facebook, anything that you are using or rather misusing, you need to really assess yourself. Where is social media taking you? There are so many incidents that we are seeing around the world, around the world that people are actually really, really losing the capacity, the will to think because they've relied so heavily on these influences on this TikTok platform, on the Facebook platform, that you're making the rich rich and you're making the poor poor. And isn't this something that Hazubat Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam came to eradicate? This jahliya, this ignorance, this lack of education. People aren't getting an education, but they're finding that becoming, they are getting a decent job. They're finding that being an Instagrammer or being a TikToker is an actual job, it's a profession. But what we need to realize is if you're misusing that, you're misleading the youth, you're misleading individuals, you're misleading the community, you're misleading the ummah. Where is that taking you? And then obviously when you are going to do negative, you're going to receive negative. You can't have a negative plus a negative equals a positive. That doesn't work. Even in my mathematical equation, that isn't going to work. So we need to really reflect and ponder upon ourselves. Where is social media taking us? We have six-year-olds, eight-year-olds now who have a phone, who have a mobile phone. The first scrutiny and accountability is upon the parents. How are the parents allowing this? How are the parents giving the child a phone? Are they that savvy? Are they that aware? There are so many bad bad things that are happening in the world we have paedophiles we have individuals who have ill thinking who want to abuse children and you're allowing your child who is very naive who is not very savvy who isn't plucked up to this world to this communication level they're only six they're only eight they're only 10 or 11 they're going through the phases of learning you're providing them with a platform to technically be abused so you as a parent need to have first accountability. You need to be scrutinized first. You need to check, are you just giving your child the phone because you just want them out of your face and you just want them to get out of your hair and just sit to the side? Well, what kind of parenting is that? We need to have these conversations. The ulema, the fuqaha, we all need to have these conversations and talk and talk in our masajids. Unless we have this taboo topic talked about, this is not going to be eradicated from society. And it's really, really worrying that young children are at the stage, Muslim young children are at that stage where they're having to look to mental health issues, look to commit suicide, because they're, they're given that freedom from a very young age. We really need to reflect and we really need to ponder. And my direct message to those individuals who are the TikTokers, who are the Instagrammers, and if you're misusing and abusing that position, then please stop. I have a YouTube channel, so in essence, I am part of the SM social media bandwagon. But you all know that I do not misuse it. Alhamdulillah, I am portraying Islam on my channel. I'm trying to spread the deen. I'm trying to do dawah to a worldwide platform. I have my viewers that watch from Bangladesh, from India, from Pakistan, obviously from the UK where I'm from. I have people from France, from Amsterdam, Alhamdulillah, Bangladesh. All these individuals watch my videos. But I don't do it for views. I don't do it for likes. I don't do it for any monetary gain. My purpose is to change one heart. And if that one heart is changed, Alhamdulillah, I don't know. That one heart might be the reason why I get Jannah. We need to start thinking like this. We really need to stop with this music and this dubbing. And I don't know, the, the era just keeps changing. It was first dub, voice dubs, and then it was some music platforms. It just keeps changing. Now we're on the platform of the era of TikTok. And then in the future, we're going to have something else. So until we nip this in the bud, these platforms aren't going to stop and we're just going to get polluted. 
please spread this message please spread this message spread it to as many people as you know and if you are a parent who has a young child in the house and they have a phone reflect do they really need one do they really need one 21st century that we're in the era that we're in is going to get even worse in the future so if we have to protect our children we really need to really be looking at them and accountability is on us so look after yourself inshallah and I shall see you next week in another video. Allah Hafiz.